Hi, and welcome to Inside the Newsroom. I'm Andrews Gyllenhaal, the Herald's executive editor. Let me start today with a quick question perfect for this July 4th weekend. How many of the five freedoms can you think of that are listed in the First Amendment? If you're like most of us, you'll get freedom of speech, freedom of press, freedom of religion right off the bat, and then struggle to come up with the right to assemble and the right to petition the government. Like the U.S. Constitution itself, the 45 words in the First Amendment, starting out, Congress shall make no law, have sprawling and profound impacts on our lives that rarely get much attention. And that's the reason for a new public service campaign that I wanted to introduce you to that hopes to build awareness for the First Amendment. It started this week in newspapers, including the Herald, as well as magazines, television, radio stations. You won't be surprised uh, to know that those who work in the media have a special appreciation for freedom of speech. But the whole point of this campaign is to remind ourselves that the First Amendment is much broader than simply press freedom that its five rights make up one of the great distinctions of our system of government. And this is one of the few places in the world where a whole body of law has built up to ensure that you can say what you want, write what you wish, worship however you want, protest in favor or against anything that you'd like to. The campaign called One for All emphasizes that this is the one amendment that every American uses and that it provides the right to speak out against injustices, to protest, to petition, to speak your mind. Look for ads in the coming weeks, or if you'd like to learn more about it, turn to the website at this address. As always, thank you for your emails, letters, phone calls, protests, and grievances, and thank you for reading The Herald and spending time here on MiamiHerald.com.